Want to learn how to create a seamless plate pattern from scratch using the Procreate app? Look no further. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how easy it is to do that. Hello there, Stephanie here from My Prince Collection, the place where I share you the best ways for you to use the Procreate app so that you can make money online. This tutorial is one of the tutorials of the Texture Series Plate Edition for Procreate. Let's learn how to create a seamless plate pattern using the Procreate app. Let's open the Procreate app. I'm gonna add a new canvas for this project. We are gonna use a, a, a 1000 by 1000 pixel, 72 dpi's, and we, are, we click on create, but I have my canvas ready to go over here. Let me decrease a little bit. I'm gonna turn on the uh, drawing guide. So go to the actions canvas, turn on the drawing guide, edit the drawing guide. And I'm using the two grid opacity maximum, thickness 50, 64. And the grid size we are gonna with 250, which is a quarter of 1000 to have this four by four square. We are gonna click here on done and there you go. So now I'm going to increase this quite a bit. I'm going to make sure that the color pure black is selected. Go to the to my selection tool. Make sure that rectangle is selected and the color fill is uh, selected as well. Now I'm going to draw my rectangle. So make sure that it touch those lines over here, our guide. Now I'm going to duplicate this layer. I'm going to decrease this a little bit like this. And I'm going to select this and move it over here until it snaps. I'm going to merge these two layers, duplicate it, select, move it until it snaps again. And decrease. I'm going to merge down, duplicate this layer and move it over here. So like this. Okay. And now I'm going to duplicate this one again and put it over here and merge these three layers. So I'm happy with the first step of our pattern. Now we are going to repeat it in a seamless pattern five times. I'm going to show you the first one. So go to your layers, duplicate this three times. Now you have four layers. Go to the first layer, selection tool and drag it until it snaps. Second layer, drag it until it snaps. Third layer, drag it until it snaps. And fourth layer, drag it until it snaps. I'm gonna keep doing this process. Now I'm gonna merge and keep repeating the process. <music> With my pattern, I can turn off the drawing guide. I'm gonna go to the layers, duplicate this layer, and on the top one, I'm gonna go to my um, adjustments, clear, click on glitch. I'm gonna use the artificial amount, will be a hundred percent, block size will be one percent, and the zoom a hundred percent. Now I'm gonna swipe to the right until I reach 22. Okay. I'm happy with this, so now I'm going to merge these two layers. Click on Merge Down. I'm going to duplicate this layer and the one above. I'm going to go to my Adjustments and I'm going to go to Gaussian Blur and swipe until I reach around 4% and I'm going to decrease the opacity to, let's go with 30%. Okay. So I'm happy with this. I'm going to merge down. So we've created the first step of our pattern. Let's create the second um, bit. So I'm going to turn off this layer. I'm going to add a new layer. And now I'm going to go to my selection tool, rectangle selected, color black selected. And here is a little bit how you want it to do. So I'm going to uh, draw two, three rectangles like this. 
so perfect okay now that i have this one i'm gonna duplicate this one this layer select and rotate the 90 percent so click here rotate the 45 twice okay and i'm gonna reduce the opacity of both to 50 percent so the first one 50 percent the second one 50 percent okay like so so now i'm gonna click here on uh, merge down i'm gonna turn my previous layer on and i want this white bit to to show so to do so i'm gonna go to this layer click on select and turn off the color fill invert go back to my previous layer with this pattern and click on clear and there you go we've just created a plaid seamless pattern and we are done we have created a seamless plaid pattern using the procreate app in the next tutorial i'm going to share how to create a seamless plaid procreate brush question do you like this kind of tutorials where i teach you how to create seamless patterns in procreate let me know in the comments below which pattern i should do next and make sure to subscribe to the channel if you like seamless plaid procreate brushes make sure to check out my full plaid procreate brush set or just grab a sample from this set the links will be in the description below thank you so much for watching and until the next video happy drills and illustrations